If you guys have watched our vaccination video, you would probably already know how the COVID-19 vaccines we have in Singapore work. But do you know what happens to your body after you get vaccinated? Today, we will be showing you how your body becomes protected after you get your vaccination. In our earlier video, we showed that the vaccine is an instructional booklet that taught your body how to create the spikes of the virus that causes COVID-19, which is then used to train your body's immune system to recognise those spikes. Once your body recognises these spikes, your body can then stop the virus itself from entering your cells more effectively. Having said that, how does your body actually recognise the spikes? Do the viruses give out business cards? Do the immune cells have Wakanda facial recognition technology? Interestingly, the real answer is sort of like a combination of the two. Remember the spike proteins that were created early on by the vaccine? Well, they have a very specific shape that allows them to unlock the doors into our cells, in turn triggering an immune response. Different types of harmful viruses have very different shapes and structures which makes them sort of like a name tag, something that your body can recognise. The spikes are the name tags of the virus that causes COVID-19. When we are fighting these spike proteins, our cells learn how to make antibodies that act like locks. These locks are Y-shaped proteins that are super specific and these antibodies are able to seek out and attach themselves to the spike proteins. They are hyper-specialised because their tips have binding agents that bind specifically to the kind of spikes they are made to target. So, different kinds of antibodies will be created during the fight against the spike proteins, but only a small percentage can stop the virus from attacking our body. These antibodies are known as the neutralizing antibodies. Neutralizing antibodies are one of the most important factors to gain protection against a virus. And this is also the reason why most vaccines focus mainly on the spike proteins, because this gives our body the highest chances of creating neutralizing antibodies or drones to fight the virus that causes COVID-19. So in the case where the actual virus does invade, your body will be able to identify them via their name tags and send the neutralizing drones in to stop them. These neutralizing drones can develop during a natural infection as well, but the body suffers so much more going through an entire COVID-19 episode, which is why our government is urging anyone who's eligible to take up the vaccination so that we can protect ourselves and our loved ones as well. Now that you know how your body identifies and fights the COVID-19 virus with the help of vaccines, your next question will probably be, how do I know if my body has created neutralizing antibodies after I get my vaccination? Currently, there are several ways to test it out using the gold standard technology that is being widely used in research. But it is pretty difficult to set it up and carry it out commercially. However, our scientists in Singapore have invented a new technology called the CPAS Surrogate Neutralization Test. It is a big name, but effectively, it is a test kit that can detect the presence and measure these spike neutralizing drones in your body, which in turn will let you know if the vaccination has worked for you. We'll let its inventor share a little bit more about it. Hello, my name is Lin Fa Wang. I'm a professor at the Duke in Yes Medical School. Our team invented the CPAS Diagnostic Kit, which was specifically designed to determine neutralizing antibodies from COVID-19 patients or those who received the COVID-19 vaccine. Neutralizing antibody is the only biomarker for protection that we can measure at large scale. CPAS can be a good tool to search for the spike neutralizing drones in our body and to make sure that you are not the 5% that doesn't react to the vaccines. Better safe than sorry, right? Scientists have also found that these neutralizing drones can decrease over time in vaccinated people and it differs from person to person. Some may have it for decades while others may have it for several months. Individuals can choose to get tested every six months to check if these neutralizing drones are still in the body. If you are curious whether your vaccination jab has worked, you may always ask your doctor for a CPAS test. To date, CPAS remains the first and only US FDA approved kit to be used under emergency authorization to test for neutralizing antibodies, making Singapore a true leader in fighting COVID-19. I hope you guys learned a little bit more about vaccination today and the importance of neutralizing drones in your body. Just keep thinking!